Triple bottom line approach and 3P of sustainability. What does it mean? What does it mean 3P of sustainability? As already you understand, 3P it means uh, the capital letter of uh, three words. These three words people, planet, and profit. These criteria used to uh, understand is your uh, business is your procurement uh, approach sustainable or not let's see what does it mean and how uh, evaluate your procurement approach in terms of these three p's and what does it mean to triple bottom line approach when you look at this picture with three circles which uh, are connected to each other you will see that everything is interconnected in our life and of course in our uh, procurement uh, activities and you will see here the place where all three circles uh, uh, interconnected and cover each other we can be sure that our activity our procurement is sustainable and we uh, we uh, follow all these elements of sus sustainability. And uh, let's uh, uh, go deeper and uh, I will explain you what does it mean sustainable in terms of planet, sustainable in terms of people and sustainable in terms of profit. Uh, of course, uh, when we talk about planet, it is clear for everybody. It is about green procurement with less carbon food, with less pollutions and uh, less uh, wasting um, materials and uh, less influence uh, on the nature. But uh, when we talk about people, what does it mean, people dimension? First of all, it is about our social activity. When we talk about people, uh, it means that uh, we need to answer the questions. What our influence to the people who work in our company and how we can influence to uh, our customers, uh, our uh, suppliers and other stakeholders and manufacturers. Also, it is very important uh, how we can influence to the community where located, for example, our factory or located our uh, pr production. And uh, you need to ask yourself and answer this question. Uh, can we uh, return something back to this local society? Sometimes it happens that local society doesn't support your uh, um, uh, production or your activity and you need to negotiate with this um, uh, community, you need to uh, collaborate with this community to deliver them that you uh, don't make any harm to the nature, for example, or any harm to, to this society, to this community. And when we talk about uh, people, it's also very important to follow these ethical principles, ethical standards uh, don't harm to uh, local society and we care about people involved in the procurement process. So with people it is clear. Let's talk about planet. Uh, planet it is about uh, all our actions which can influence to the nature in the wide meaning of this world. It can be connected to the nature of the, the uh, region uh, where we operate, of the region where we work. Or for example, if you are a big global company, how your activity influence to the nature in general in the world. Uh, do you have uh, in place uh, approach for supporting renewable energy, for example, or you use and replenish natural resources. For example, you use um, uh, some wooden elements and uh, you buy it all the time. 
can you uh, support activity to increase uh, number of trees, increase forests in the region? Can you invest money in these projects? Can you support this activity? Etc. 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 So uh, please evaluate your uh, procurement activity in terms of influencing uh, on the planet. And the last one, profit. What does it mean? Why we need to include like sustainable factor is uh, profit. Is it so important to uh, support profitability, your profitability? Of course, it is very important, but uh, are we care about profitability of, your, of our suppliers or our customers? When we talk about sustainable approach, it is very important because profitability and sustainability of your suppliers uh, influence on uh, your risks, influence on uh, uh, the quality of your cooperation with uh, these suppliers. And it means that it is very important to understand and to be sure that your suppliers and uh, your cooperation with these suppliers is profitable. And they can support this level of profit on the necessary way. And please, when you evaluate uh, your cooperation with supplier, take it into the account that they earn money in the contract with you. They earn money and they are stable in their growth and in their continuity of uh, cooperation with you and it allows uh, them uh, to work in a good and quality way and allows to uh, uh, grant and give back to the community and everything interconnected as I mentioned already. And of course uh, profitability um, make a long-term impact into the ecosystem in general, business system, and into your relationships with these suppliers and to the market in general. So I think now you understand how it is important to understand the elements of the sustainability and support all these three Ps to be sure that your procurement activity sustainable and it is in consistency with your sustainable strategy in the company. Want to learn supply chain in an easy to understand format and take your career to the next level? Head over to scmdojo.com.